weather with 27 Storm Tracks, Catherine Noel. Hey there, everyone. So we have a nice mix of sun and clouds right now. That sun is just trying to push through and it will at times, but then we're also going to get some cloudy weather today. 59 degrees though, that is not stopping us from warming up. It feels like 59 out there and it's definitely breezy. So temperatures right now, what's going to happen as we go on throughout the day? It's that southwest corner that's definitely going to warm up first as we normally see getting to the 60s already right now in some areas, the low 60s, 61 in Janesville, but that northern area, Stevens Point, if you are north of that, and especially if you're north of Montello, you're going to be a bit cooler. And if you're off to the east, a bit cooler than the rest of us because of that lakeshore breeze, but still warmer than yesterday by no means. I mean, 10, 15 degrees warmer right now and eventually 20 degrees warmer when we're talking about our high temps. That breeze is kicking in coming from the southeast and that continues to pull in warmer air that paired with our warm front that's just getting to the start of us. So it's going to lift up and let us really warm up. The windy conditions stay with us throughout the day until later on. I think around 738 you'll notice you'll notice that we start to get, you know, a little bit of some decrease in our speeds and then tomorrow just a slight breeze. That precipitation does stay to the north though, so we stay dry today. Our moisture is really just coming in terms of cloud cover. Tomorrow is our day for the rain and the storms, but really not until the second half of the day. So we have a low pressure system that's just been slowly getting closer to us and it's going to do a lot to our weather. So I mean, the first thing which we're already experiencing warmer temperatures, right? We get underneath this warm front here. It'll just lift to the north as we go on throughout the day, letting us warm up quite a bit. And then that cold front pushes in on Tuesday, and that's going to determine who gets the storms and when exactly, and even a chance of severe weather. Here's a look at temperatures as we go on the mid 60s, getting to 70, very possible, especially if you are in Grant County. I mean, just before dinner time, it's going to be very nice outside. And if you are near the Illinois border, 74 potentially for Janesville, 73 for Monroe. Definitely warmer compared than the 50s that we felt for a high temp yesterday. Waking up to the 50s likely tomorrow morning at 7 o'clock. So that means you know we're going to be warm. We don't have much to go up higher from. I mean, it takes a few hours really until we get to the 70s and then the upper 70s, potentially an 80 for some. Janesville, maybe 80 degrees tomorrow would be our first of the year but definitely a bit cooler to the north, still staying in the 50s. Nonetheless, definitely warmer than what we've been seeing over the weekend. We will get a little bit of some daytime heating from the sun tomorrow, but we would want more for some storms, so we'll see how this plays out. We stay mainly dry. It's really 6, 7 o'clock when we start to get those storms pushing through. Some models want to make it, you know, coming through Dane County and a little bit more to our south, but some do keep it to the north, so we'll see how this plays out tomorrow. A slight, slight, slight chance we have a marginal threat for severe weather. This looks kind of not likely. So once again, we'll see how this plays out. But we do get some rain pushing on in overnight and then we're a bit drier Wednesday. Just Wednesday morning, we do have a chance for some showers, but very brief. Warm today, 70 for your high. Overnight, we stay warm too. 58 for a low temperature. That's close to our high and what we normally see this time of year. 62, close to 80 tomorrow. 79, a chance for storms pushing in during the evening and then overnight. Your extended forecast shows after the storms Tuesday, we start to cool down a bit back to the 60s, but still near our average. Really nice weather as we go on throughout the week, feeling very seasonal. Another chance for rain on Sunday. Nice to see those warmer temps. Oh, yeah. Okay, <laughs> Catherine, thank you.